Hey y'all, you can't see. This light ain't working. Uh oh, okay, so I'm a Cassidy Cracker. I was gonna gig the tour heading downstairs, but there's a light out. I'll try not to fall and die. Oh, look, it probably help my little subs. Hang in there, guys. I can't see any better than I can, really. What? Where was that? <laughs> Up here at the top of the stairs. Ah. Uh, what was I hitting? All right, we're going back to first base. This one? That's outside. I did that. That's outside. Oh, uh, okay. It's like Helen Keller, folks. Oh, my God. So which one did you hit? This one right here. That's for the here? Oh, my goodness. Okay, so we're heading down to, <laughs> we're heading down to uh, headquarters. Down in the For a guy who loves horror movies, this is perfect. But I'm over at Crackers. So here's head, here's headquarters for all things whitey and cracker for anyone who's ever cared. But I did I did a bit of a tour before. Broheim's got all kinds of stuff, and that dude's been part of the show for years now, and it's always been a mess. Yep. It's not my fault. Do we got a light for back there? Yeah. Uh, It'll get brighter after a while. But we had, uh, we've been coming down here since what, 15? Uh, you 14? were still in the trailer park, and it was a night where your sister was over, and you're like, we can't do stuff. I'm like, come to my house. Oh, Let's my go God. In the basement. And then you looked at our basement, and you're like, why didn't we do this? Why years haven't years? we been doing this the whole time? Yeah. So, whenever that was. Yeah. How old? Are, God, I'm coming up on 37, dude. I'll be 38, October. It hurts. It hurts where I pee. And look where we are in our life. <laughs> I know. The same place we were when we were in high school. Making just as much money. Or lack thereof. I think you're making less money, aren't you? That's a sound. Oh, Don't even start. <laughs> That's what friends are for, to remind people <sighs> of this stuff. Yeah. If you need a good swift kick in the balls, this is the guy. Here we got Nightmare. Hey, Mrs. Cracker. Oh, are you live, actually? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just figured... Oh, well, remember how you said no notifications? I didn't get a notification. So. Anyway. Because you're not subbed because they keep kicking you off. No, they keep kicking you off my channel. Oh, my God. I'm always subbed to your channel. My fucking world, man. My fucking world. Here's the Nightmare on Elm Street collection. Yeah, VHS stuff. I keep it, even though I have them all on blue, I just keep it for decorations because yeah. like, that just looks cool. I like it does. In the background. I used to have it, you know, back there with the other box collections, but since we did like our little command center yeah. thing, it's, and we, it's, should. we just use it to prop everything if up. Because we, we have these lights here. Um... And this goes back to when I was like, I'm going to be a filmmaker when I grow up. Mm -hmm. Now I'm on death's door and gives a <laughs> shit. But uh, I was like, this is our headlight. And then right right here, we over here, we'd set up uh, the key light and then have a fill light behind his gut. And then we would sit. Yeah. We would sit where we're sitting, mm -hmm. do our little show. And it amounted to jack shit. Yeah, well, what was what was great is you used to have like your really cool like old school camera here. Yeah. But the problem is you didn't have a remote. So yeah. You had to I, I'd have here, to run so over like here. The first like ten seconds of the video was you walking back my and sitting down. Exorbitant gut making its way back in the frame. Yeah. So good times, nightmares really, but. We can laugh now that it's in the past. Everyone else laughs at us, but I can't wait. Yeah, we might as well. This is actually tidier than it's what it's been historically. Yeah, I've thrown away a lot of stuff. I've sold a lot of stuff. Like Really? Like, well, yeah, a lot of these like wrestling tapes that you've shown in our last, your last Cassidy Cracker mm -hmm. walkthrough, 
I found a lot of people that still watch wrestling VHS tapes for some reason. I I so much like made forty five bucks. Okay. Selling stuff that's been sitting here for like two years, covered in dust. Yeah. But yeah, I'm just getting there. It is. Crap. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do some some movies. I'm actually on Volk Party now just because it's the phone I grabbed. Okay. But that's fine. I mean, views are views at this point. It doesn't matter what we're doing. Oh, I think our plans are we're going to shoot some reviews for my channel. Hi, Misery. We're going to shoot some reviews for my channel. These are, I guess, our plans. We got some Trey and Matt coming out. Misery says hi, Eric. Hi, Misery. And then we're going to cleanse the palate of Trey and Matt with Young Guns. Yes. And seven. I'm going to do some, some history versus Hollywood. And then after we're done with that, we're going <laughs> to... We'll go live again. Do you have your laptop? Yeah. Oh, okay. But I just, I figured I'd give them the tour coming down the stairs. Um, jeez. I'm like, I've lost some weight and I yeah. have, but there's still so much left. Oh my god. And it says the man who just came back from McDonald's. You just came Yeah, you yeah. did just come back from McDonald's. It's not it's like every week you either got Taco Bell. Or last week was yeah. Jimmy John's. See? So it's my fault that you can't lose weight because I'm always hanging out with you and I'm always eating shit. No, I eat <laughs> shit no matter how I'm around. And I get I get a lot of exercise. My ass is all toned in Brazilian now. <laughs> shit. <laughs> that sounds really gross. Not the whole, the cheeks, dude. The cheeks. Hey, you work at an old folks' home. <laughs> it could be anything. I and that's the thing too. Like I feel young and spry. Oh, young and spry. That's why they like you. Everybody else is dying slowly. See, maybe that's what it is. You look better by comparison. I do because it's I all do. old people. There. You want to feel and, and like I was talking to one lady the other day, and it's, it's this really weird balance because I want to be like friendly and affable, mm -hmm. but I don't want to be intrusive into their medical circumstances. Mm -hmm. And she said she was DNR, which is do not resuscitate. resuscitate. I'm yeah. like, oh my god, well, yeah, I'll take you out for a smoke. We're all dying. Think about it. Yeah, no shit. Ah, oh, the, from the day we're born. Let's see if I got a not notification. I did not. So this is vote party as well. Okay. And I need a I need a better thing than that. It's just my face. <laughs> well, you can put in this is the thumbnails and stuff. But yeah, but I'm you've done that before. 177 subs on this one. So all you kids at home, if you could tell your friends, but our friends don't have friends. We <laughs> are our friends. You guys friends. are our friends. Yeah. Oh yeah. I got a oh so quick story. Misery says. I don't know if you can read that. You can, yeah, I can see. You, I don't have to be. And I don't care she, if I'm on camera or not. She said, uh, I, uh, there's right across the street from me in the town where I work. You know where oh. I work, right? There's a little boutique. Good I've never idea. been. So I went in there and I got this for 12 bucks. And uh, everybody works been complimenting me. I uh, trimmed my beard and everyone thought I, I had a haircut. That. Everyone thought I had a haircut. Yeah. That shows how much they fucking pay attention. Uh, Mrs. Cracker says she wants you to show the tour of our creepy rooms in here. Have you ever been to our creepy rooms? I don't think I've been to the creepy room. So. All right. We're, apparently, we're getting to two of the creepy rooms. This was her idea, so if you die, that's on her. Oh, yeah. Well, I think, you know, if anybody's going to get me killed, it's you guys. Hey, that's what I'm so, This is uh, the first Texas Chainsaw I've Massacre never, room. I don't know that I've been in there. This is the first Texas Chainsaw Massacre room. It looks bank and disturbing. How much shit do you guys have? Well, this shit isn't ours. This was left here when we moved in. I'm afraid to look in it because we've been in here. Yeah. We've been here since. It's a, it's it's a severed head. I'm pretty sure. Um, this is probably disgusting. This is not ours. This has been here. Yeah. Since we moved in. That microwave has been here since we moved in. Yeah. So. That's you know where they keep the bodies. This is like that Home Alone thing. Mm -hmm. It's like he shovels the silt into the. Ah, we have a room for that. <laughs> I'll show you. <laughs> Okay, so we got that creepy room, and we got the next creepy room, complete with lock on the outside, old timey like wooden yeah. lock. I like that. This is just where I store all my crap that I'm selling online. So this is somewhat creepy. You got a big one of those creepy bugs right there. 
more like those things. Centipede. Yeah. So, but this is just storage room. Yeah. But creepy. Backwoods creepy. And then... If we find Jimmy Hoffa, he owes back rent like a motherfucker. Now, Jimmy Hoffa might be in this one. This is the room I never go into because it's extra creepy because it goes all the way back. And I'm going to have you walk see, so it's what? really old timey. Wow. Old school. No light bulb in there. Oh, uh, yeah, I can't see shit. So I, it's hold on. the I people right under now. the stairs kind of situation. I got a light bulb. For those of you who can't see what the fuck is happening. Portuguese man of war and the colloquial name of the critters. It was critters. Oh, okay. Uh, Misery there. says that bug was a Portuguese man of war. You can walk war. in there with that. Holy shit, there's a hook left and everything. Oh, fuck me. I got your phone, dude. <laughs> I don't care. And you're like the only man I know probably doesn't have it. Picks on it. Because oh. I'm smart. A, I'm married, and B... Yeah, that's 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 where the that's where the virgins meet their fate, misery. That's you just saw it. A, I'm married, so I wouldn't do. What's pics. this? Is B, this? That's will get you in trouble because someone will send it to everybody. Yeah. Oh, these are also other weird rooms. More virgin sacrifices going there. Right. Right. None of this is ours. This was here when we moved in. So, it begs the question, though, like, I know it's a cultural thing, but when you do sacrifice virgins, why doesn't somebody hop in and just fuck them real quick so they don't die? Like, you know? Maybe they wait till they die. To Help a them. buddy out. And then, see, more garbage that isn't ours. Okay. And then the water softener thing. Well, what that's kind, it. What kind of culture kills off the virgin hot chicks, like... Fuck the gods. Who said that they were hot chicks? They're just uh, Yeah, I don't know. They could look like us. Maybe that, they're just always portrayed as such in the films because the that's Hollywood. The director wants to get a blowjob. Yeah, that's how they get the roll. So there you go. There's our creepy. Story. That's the yeah. Welcome to Creepy Day Cracker. Creepy Day Cracker. And they've seen my basement though, so. And it is colder than a witch's tit down here. My penis is a popsicle at this point. <laughs> and by the end of the night, it'll go. It'll be an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> an instead of an Audi. Oh my god. Okay, we're back. There you go. That was the that was the two cent tour, and it cost you nothing. Oh shit. Two cent tour, and you feel ripped off. Yeah, I, I do. It's like that Simpsons. I'm not moment. touching that. So now, what are we doing? Uh, well. I was. We were going to go on my channel and review some of this stuff. Let's hop on your channel, bro. Oh, you're going to be live while we do it? Yeah. Now, are you going to be able to pay attention to talking about the movie, even though people are going to be talking to you? Because, you know... Oh, a blue car. It distracts you really easy. You know, yes. I'm just going to default yes. I'll be fine. Okay. You know, have you you've played Halo at all? No. Okay, there's a bit. It's actually... It's 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Fuck you, Australia. We've got 100 feet of snow in Illinois. Yeah, but see, the thing is, we're fat. We wouldn't be able to handle the 100-degree weather. No, I would be miserable. I'm, I'm, and and I was, I was, Dad came to stop by, and he was like, good to see you and shit. And we're driving down the road, and I'm like, isn't it great? Look, it's 25 degrees. And it's like, yay, it's almost spring. 25 entire degrees. We're not talking hundreds of a degree or tenths of a degree. But the full degree <clears throat> in Illinois. I did. <laughs> and what was it? Go ahead and start that yeah. fire that bad boy up. Just like a couple of weeks ago, we were <coughs> negative like 20. And then yeah. in a couple of days, we'll be at 19. Oh. But we're at like 37 now. 37. Why are we wearing all these clothes? Because we want to keep subscribers. We don't, they they don't want to see us naked. There's that one guy, Smash Room Vid, who's like, show me your dick a lot. So, uh, Maybe, you know, if he'd he give me more subs, you know, if I made money doing it, I'd be like, here's my white guy penis that could be impressive to anybody but a series of gay dudes. Hey, I got a, I got a notification. There we go. 
<laughs> you got a notification that your own channel is live. Good for you. Yay! But that's why that's why the white guy uh, politics. Okay. So the plan is we're gonna. Oh, m misery wants us naked. <laughs> well, misery wants you naked. Okay, misery. Go back two weeks in Whitey's timeline. Yeah. I took the, the <laughs> I took the uh, thumbnail. If you like stretch marks? Yeah, I, I look did. Like I, a map. I took this. I took the thumbnail picture for his live stream, and it is his nipple. And it was it was it was me doing this with no shirt. And, and that's a know. legit. So there you go. And then I was. You like, can scroll down here. We need more here, subs. You can scroll down here. It'll say what it is. <laughs> I know I gave it a really mean name for you. Okay. What are we doing? Which which it's, it's, which video is it? Um, it was it on Volt Party though, or was it the other one? Oh, I don't fucking know. It might have been. A, I think it was another one. It might have been on politics. But I'm not wearing a shirt in my John Wayne video. If and sometimes you see some titties. I need to. I need to. You need pasties. Pasties. <laughs> I need to get those clip-on things. Clothespins. No, with the little the little doodads that hang on the strippers. <laughs> You're disgusting. I know. Okay. So, Irish. so the plan is we're going to, I'm not going live with this stuff. So we're not going live with these videos because I'm going to upload them later. Okay. Um, and then. Tassels. Tassels. You know who said tassels? Your wife. She's in the know. She's got boobs. Yeah. Okay. Um, our plan is we're going to review these films. Um, and then I will upload them as I see fit. And then I will charge my phone, and then I guess you said you're going to stay live the whole time? Yeah, that's okay. my plan. So Whitey's going to try to focus on <laughs> at least for my channel's sake Yeah. his stuff, and then we can scroll back and communicate. And then I'll plug my phone in, and then we can go live on, I guess, both channels of yours. Yeah. Then after my phone is charged again, we can have the command center going. Sound good? Let's do it. We can knock these out and what? Couple days. Well, I mean, we'll get this reviewed for, for what less than an hour. We'll have all these done. Yeah. Okay. And if all else fails, we don't have to do all of them. But I, we're at least going to do seven and Young Guns for sure. Absolutely. So, because I've been wanting to talk about seven for a while, and you suggested Young Guns, so we'll at least talk about that as well. Because we talked about Young Guns a little bit last time you were over here, last time. Because you were talking about how. Uh, was it Dirty Steve? Wasn't a real person or something like that? Composite characters. Yeah, so we'll, 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 I'll let you lead the, the Young Guns review, but we'll at least get going on seven, and we're all playing it by ear. Sweet. So let me know when you are ready. Okay, I'm, I'm on Why Do the White Guys show now. You're the only person who talks to me on this channel. Okay, that's good. <laughs> so... I'm gonna I'm gonna work on this. You work on, and need then need you're cleaning. working on that. My well, lens needs there you cleaning. Go. What should I call this over here? Just shooting the shit. Fuzzy nipples. No pasties. Pasties. <laughs> pasties. <laughs> yes. Maybe if people understood the context of what the fuck we are ever talking. about. Well, if they about. watched your other channel, they would know. Yeah. See, it takes some dedication. And some love and affection. There you go. I think I spelled that right. I have no idea. It doesn't matter. Again, like I said, I'm the, you, like you said, I'm the only you're, I'm the only one that watches. So I don't care about the. Let's see here. Video. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh look. See look. There's a notification. Yeah. We were talking earlier about um, a lot of the people who subbed to me over the years, their channels get deleted, and that's why I don't have more subs. Split split seven 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 is with us. Okay. Let's see how this works. Ah. <laughs> You're coming. You should read it. Oh wait, let me get the button. I guess this one. Oops. Okay. Anyone else think it is kind of funny to see the Nightmare on Elm Street box set on top of a kid's Play-Doh set? Actually, it is quite funny. It is. It is. It tells us, you know, about who you are. Exactly. I'm a dad. 
I like horror movies. Yeah, and you got a kid. Yeah. And I hang in the basement with you. A little whippersnapper. All right. He does have a good kid. We just don't want her to be on the oh, Yeah, I don't want her to be on YouTube. Privacy state. Ruin her fragile little life. All right, now. So. You're you going to put that down? Am I? So, because you're going to be here, remember? Yeah. So I don't want you, like, holding. Like, I'm not professional, but I want it to at least look like an actual video that we're doing. You know what I mean? I'm working on it. Oh, my fucking hell. Fuck! <laughs> Professional fucking show. Okay, we're in frame here, we're in frame there. I don't know how to get us in frame. Maybe this way? Uh, well, you're gonna turn off your phone. Okay, hold on. I need a place, I need a placeholder. Like we're kicking a field goal. It's an issue. Is that good enough for at least now? No, can we push this back? Because there's nothing behind it. That's good enough for now. Okay. You guys so, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... One woman in the whole world and a bunch of dudes are just like, yeah, keep going. <laughs> just keep going. Yeah, because my wife definitely doesn't want to see that. No. She's seen you rub your nipples enough. Yeah, well, it was waiting. That was waiting. Because. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going good here. We're going to, oh, so for everybody on Whitey White Guys Show, how do you do? I'm Whitey, this is Cracker, and we're going to be reviewing some films here in a moment. So what are yeah. we starting with? Um, just so you guys know, and not you guys because no one's watching over here. You always watch no um, Whitey obviously isn't ignoring you. He's just going to focus on talking about this stuff first, and then after we're done, what we'll do is, okay, Whitey, that was creepy. <laughs> He's a creepy guy. What we'll do is they'll still be able to watch because you're live streaming. Yeah. Um, we'll talk a movie, and then we'll take a little bit of break so you can catch up on comments, and then we'll do the next movie. Okay. Sound good? Let's roll. All right. You want to do seven, or you want to do Young Guns first? Start with seven. Okay. This came out when? 90. 95? Yeah, mid-90s. Yep, 95. All right. Absolutely. All right. Wow, you get four subs. Uh, Watch viewers. Years. Viewers is the huh? proper nomenclature. <laughs> you are a retard. All right, am I starting to talk about this? Oh, we'll do it the old school way. Okay. Well, this is for my channel, so I'll oh, do the okay. whole Hey Internet, Eric here, yeah. Whitey's here. We're going to talk about seven and all Lead that jazz. charge, Captain Custer. <laughs> all right. Hey Internet, Eric here. Buddy Whitey's here. We've actually got some positive feedback yeah. the last few times Whitey's been here. Um, He's... He's gonna easily be dis he's gonna easily be distracted because his dumbass decided to go live on both of his channels while I'm filming this. Um, but we're gonna try our best. I've still got one more phone, motherfucker. I know. I've still got one more phone. Right. We're gonna try our best in this review. Um, today, one of my favorite films of all time. If it's you know, it's not my favorite, but it's definitely in top two. Today we're going to talk about the film Seven. Seven. Came out in ninety five, directed by David Fincher. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I discuss plot spoilers, specific saints. Movie came out in 95, so fucking catch up. Yep. Um, basic plot of Seven is we're following Morgan Freeman, who plays Detective Somerset. On his way out the door, he's retiring. Mm -hmm. He meets um, his replacement, uh, Brad Pitt, plays Detective Mills. And as Morgan Freeman wants to leave, there is a bunch of murders happening well, this is basic plot. Murder's happening um, in the way of, like, the seven deadly sins. And Morgan's pulled back in to solve this one last crime while um, Brad Pitt's, like, the young rookie trying to make this be his first big break. Also, Gwyneth Paltrow. So, um, like I said, uh, this is, like, in my top two favorite movies of all time. Um, your initial thoughts? Seven was fucking... Um a masterpiece mm -hmm. it was just like all points you know there's a lot of films out there where like the writing's good and the mm -hmm. acting's good this was like they hit on all cylinders this was like a lightning in the bottle type movie yeah. because first off Morgan Freeman Morgan's always good oh ah, hey that's me that's that Whitey me. it's like you know Sorry. it's like Helen Keller <laughs> he doesn't know what he's doing um but we're not professional on this channel who fucking cares um Morgan Freeman is always great. Um, 
And he's perfect. He's the man that has seen enough shit in his career as a detective that he 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 wants out. He there's right, no that hope just, for it. Hold on, because that just gave me a data usage alert. Okay. So I'm gonna have to log off here. Okay. Because I'm using the the phone data and it's because you're probably not on the I'm Wi-Fi. Not, I'm we're not on the Wi-Fi. This again. Yeah, sorry. No, about that's fine. So uh, guys, I'm gonna log off here. I'm gonna get onto his Wi-Fi, so I'm not using phone data. Shouldn't fucking matter, but it are just you, said something. Are you on this one though? You should be on. No, 